and you can't even tell how beautifully the neck falls just looking at it like this or maybe it looks like this because i have no neck so it's forced to kind of like scrunch up um in which case i'm blessed or not so sorry <laughs> figure that out i can't help with that <laughs> Hey gems, it's Grandma's Jamima, and we are back at it again with another mother freaking video, baby. <laughs> oh, it's been five months since I said that line. <laughs> no, that's not true. I said that line, but it's been five months since I said it before a haul. <sighs> but we are back we are in a new location what do you guys think let me know let me know let me know um i hope you guys like it i hope you guys don't hear the ac that's running i consider turning it off but one thing about these halls and these lights you will get hot so we're gonna fingers cross hope and pray we're gonna be good okay but anyways, we are back with another haul. Um, today, we're going to be featuring pieces from Abercrombie and Fitch, if you can believe that. And I kept saying Abercrombie. I don't know why, but it's Abercrombie and Fitch. This is one of the brands that I always thought was very much for the blonde hair, blue eyed girl. That was very much their aesthetic. If you saw their posters, even the way the store used to smell, child, I don't know why. I know what it smelled like. I don't know why everyone went inside. But I remember back in the day when I used to work at Sephora, there was Abercrombie and Fitch across the, the hall, so I would like walk past and smell it on my way to work. And I just always thought that that store thought it was too good for us. I don't, child, I don't know, but then when I found out that they carry plus sizes, they carry plus size. And then I did a little teaser on Instagram and I found out the girls been new. Like, oh, that's where I like to get my curved jeans. That's where I like to get this and that. I'm just like, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because every time I throw it at PSA, and I say, let me know where you guys shop. I have never seen anybody tag Abercrombie and Fitch. So what's up with that? Anyways, unlike y'all fake uh, people, y'all gatekeepers, once I'm hit, I'm going to put y'all on. So I got a lot of the same pieces in different tones. Um, and I got a lot of like athleisure, comfy loungewear just because I felt like that was the safest place for me to start. <laughs> so we are going to get into the pieces. So make sure you like the video, you comment which piece is your favorite, you share with your friends, your cousins, your mama, your uncle, your daddy, all the above. Tell your daddy to also call me because he ain't been acting right. Why he not picking up my calls? Tell him I said, call me. Call me. Okay, um, and subscribe if you're not because why would you not be? I don't have to say that because you already subscribed. I know it. Anyways, uh, let's get started. <laughs> so first things first, we're going to start off with some of the base pieces that I got. Um, so I had a vision in mind. I feel like this fall, this season is like my puffer season. I'm in my puffer era. And so I'm thinking like either a long sleeve top or like a t-shirt, um, sweatpants or maybe swish wash pants um with a puffer like that's so cute great for going to run errands great for just running to a store real quick but also real comfortable and you can like spice it up with jewelry some real cute sneakers some tube socks and make it like a whole vibe right um so i got this t-shirt <laughs> um yeah this is not where the light shines for this for this brand for this company sorry to abercrombie and her homegirls because like personally for me i don't find these t-shirts becoming um it's also not like a true black it's like an off black that is like looks faded and worn like i've had it for years i've washed it in fourteen thousand cycles with the worst detergent <laughs> um i think i'm being a little dram dramatic but i mean that's what it looks like it is soft though and for me you guys know i'm very particular about where my tops end i like them to be either cropped or tunic Either you make my cheeks look fat or you don't show them at all is essentially how I like it. Just because my proportions are a little different, okay? And that's how I shop for me. Now for you, that might not be the case, which is fine. Do you, and I'm gonna do me. But yeah, so I don't like the shirt. <laughs> I don't like the color, I don't like the length. It is soft, but there's really no scenario where I would for real wear this out the house. I could potentially like fake crop it and wear it, 
but this is not worth spending your coin in my opinion it is really soft though so there's that so i picked up these i call these swish wash pants because when you walk in with that whoosh, 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 like that sound i'm sure there's a name for them i just don't know it but you know you know what i mean when i say it so you know it is what it is um i did get everything in xxl i believe um most of their things most of their pieces stop at that size there were like a couple things i went to xxxl I think like I got a jacket or something that size, but for the most part, it is in a XX though. So let's try her on, darling. Let's try her on. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh. Ooh, chow. Okay. Um, this one's a little tight. It's a little tight. And uh, <laughs> it's not as long as I want it for it to be, but that, mm, huh. yeah, it's, it's not supposed to be this tight. <laughs> Personally, this is tighter than I would like in this style of pants. I do appreciate the wide waistband though. I just feel like it really sits well on a midsection and kind of helps to also contour the midsection. Now, normally I would return these, but since you guys know I'm on my, my gym flow, these are probably gonna fit me soon. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep these, but um, if you're, if you're <laughs> on a thicker side, or if you're a true 3X like I am and you over here trying to fit the XXL, this ain't the ones. <laughs> this ain't the ones, okay? Unless you have less in the midsection. So I feel like the stomach is taken away from this area. Like if it was a little less stomach, I have a little more room. But this is giving like skin tight, honey. Like it's, it's just too small. But it's cute though. I do wish it was longer, but also because the material is being stretched around the thighs, it's probably not even really this short. <laughs> So, yeah, pockets all exposed. It's just too small, but it has potential. Functional drawstring. Um, I'm not mad at this at all. If you can get this in your size, I am not mad at this at all. I also got this in another color. And I was definitely going through something when I made my purchase. This color in particular just kept standing out to me, and I feel like it's such a beautiful neutral. I believe this is the color Dune. So you're going to see this theme, Black and Dune, throughout the entire haul for the most part. Um, they do have a pretty great selection of colors, especially for like their leggings and things, but yeah. This is the shade Dune, also cute, but um, would not recommend if this is not actually your size. And to be clear, to reiterate, I am not an XXL. I'm a 3X baddie, okay? I'm trying to force my body into these pieces. So keep that in mind. But yeah, the construction of these itself, I actually really enjoy. Next. So I picked up a pair of cargos, very scary. But once again, I don't know what I'm going through, but these tones just keep appealing to me. So I figured let's give it a try. I do love that the front is a regular pant. What is the top part? Hem, it's not a hem, is it? Whatever it is. But the back is elasticized. You guys know, I feel like that is key for the curvy girls, okay? When you have a little elastic in the back so that it'll, you know, snatch. So you don't have that much gapping in the back. But then if you do need the extra space, it'll adhere to the contour of your body without you having to get it tailored, which we love. Okay, we already spending money on clothes. It's extra nice when you don't have to spend money to get it to fit right, you know? We appreciate the little things. Okay, draw string, draw, draw string hem at the bottom. So you can leave it wide leg or Ooh, child, pray for me. Or cinch it to make it tight. Okay. Ooh, scary, a little scary, a little scary. <laughs> I knew these cargos would be a stretch. Speaking of stretch, it does have a little stretch to it. Dang. 
Okay. Okay. Snap closure. It's closing. Snap closure. Zipper. Yeah, it just doesn't cover the shelf all the way. As you can see, my shorts are still showing on the back. But other than that, these are actually pretty stinking cute. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. I wonder if like, you know, as they go on, if you keep pulling on your pants, if it'll eventually like cover the shelf. I don't know. Um, but yeah, these are cute. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, these are cute. You have pockets here. There's like 18 different compartments here. Like, I mean, dramatic. There's two. Oh, these are really cute though. OMG. Oh, I'm keeping these. Listen, if I wear an oversized sweater or a puffer, you're not gonna see the bag anyway. So, what's up? Yo, what's up? Yeah. <laughs> no, these are cute. Oh. Oh man, I wish they covered the shelf. I really wish they covered the shelf. Okay, this doesn't open anything. Why would you tease me like that? But yeah, overall, I'm a fan of these joggers. I'm a fan. Oh yes, honey. <laughs> yes. So once again, we have the color Dune coming for some airtime. Um, this is like a mock neck crop tank. It's a long crop, so it's not really meant to show torso really. And it has ruching on the side. I picked up quite a few of these. I like the material of this. It's a a and F modal blend collection piece. Love that. XXL once again. And I feel like this is going to replace my other cheaper mock neck tops that I got from like Shein and stuff. Wow, this feels like really good quality. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, uh, uh. wow. Okay. Stretches really nicely. Thank goodness. <laughs> but yeah, I figured this would be a really great way to layer a piece with slacks or something like that. Look how beautiful that is. Wowzers, ah! Oh my gosh. This is such an elevated basic. Like it's really just like a tank, but like something about the neckline just falls so beautifully. Shout out to the girls with a neck. Cause I don't have one of those. And I feel like if I did, it would be really nice to accentuate, you know, what you were gifted with. And I used to have one, but I I ate mine away. But the point is, it's cute. Oh, oh wow. Oh wow. Sorry, this is new to me. And so I feel like, am I allowed to like, get off camera, go look in the mirror? <laughs> this is cute, honey. Oh, I love this. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, honestly, even with this paired with these cargos, with a cute boot, a booty, a point toe booty, Oh my God, this is so stinking cute. Now, you, you see, you might get a little armpit fat hanging out the side. I don't mind personally, but if you do care about that, you know, she she might she might be there. But this is great for the big arm girlies because there's plenty of space for my arms to go through. Okay, and I appreciate that. Oh, I'm so glad, I'm so glad I got this in multiple colors. I believe I got this in like white and black. White, gray. Blue, oh, where's the black one? The black one's in here somewhere, but. Uh, Cause one thing about me, once I love something, I'ma get it in another color. Get it in another color. <laughs> so I got it in white. I wish I did have it like cream or off-white or like an ivory, um, but white is stunning, period. Such a good basic, oh my God. And you can't even tell how beautifully the neck falls just looking at it like this. Or maybe it looks like this because I have no neck. So it's forced to kind of like scrunch up. Um, in which case, I'm blessed or not, so sorry. <laughs> Figure that out, I can't help with that. Yeah, I can't help with that. Um, this is a nice light, I was a medium gray shade. I like this. I really like this shade of gray, honestly. I feel like this and also a light gray um, gives more elegance than it does casual because gray can look real casual real quick. I'm real finicky about the grays. 
I am, I'm not gonna lie. And this is a good one. A light gray though, beautiful. With like heavy silver accessories, I gag. And in the blue, I am trying to develop more of my navy blue collection because I struggle in this department. Um, and the more I struggle, the more I avoid it. So, you know, we're taking a hands-on approach this year. But yeah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful top. I'm gonna see how well it lasts, the material itself as I wear it. But first impressions, stunning material, stunning construction, the way it falls on the body is stunning, okay? Period, uh, period, uh. <laughs> So next I picked up these ultra high rise leggings. And I mean, I got it knowing it said ultra high rise, but I thought that meant it would fit me regular. When I tell you these are actually ultra high rise, baby, get into it. <laughs> baby, get into it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, up to the bust. That's crazy. Like, when I tell you beyond covers the shelf, oh, oh. I think I got these in the quarter length, the seven eighth length. That's typically how I prefer my leggings personally, unless they're like regular going out leggings in which I need full length, but for like workout or errands, yeah, seven eighths is my vibe. But yeah, as you can see, oh honey, she is, she is so cute. I actually already wore these out. If you saw the vlog, you would know that. I'm just gonna take pictures of these. <sighs> oh, like look at this beautiful sateen, satin, uh, reflection on these leggings they're just beautifully made like truly utterly beautifully made oh uh, that's a con with having a black background when you're wearing black you can't see. I'm trying to show y'all the uh huh anyways yeah she look good <laughs> yeah yeah she too <laughs> this is what I really fell in love with with this brand when I saw these I said oh oh baby sign me up okay so you guys know <laughs> I love a cropped situation, but I like my crop situations to be longer in the back, okay? And these days, I'm not buying sweatsuits, sweat anything from just any brand because, quite frankly, me spending money on cheaper items rather than investing in one or two really good pieces, like, I would have saved so much more money in the long run. Like, I'm tired of sweatpants where the, the, the lining, the fleece is, like, falling apart. Every time I get to the bathroom, I'm leaving, like, things behind. Every time I walk, I'm leaving things behind. Every time I wash my pants or whatever the case is, it's building up in a, in a washing machine. Like I, I don't, I don't have time, okay? Now this material is so bomb. Oh, and gee, oh. When I tell you guys I'm obsessed, this is hands down. First of all, can we get into how the skims is like doing it for me with this uh, collection? Um, Like, how are you not in love with this set? Like be for real. Be so stinking for real. Ugh. And this is one of the pieces where I said they had a plethora of colors and patterns. So you can like mix and match to see what best matches your vibe. Now, I will say that this particular legging style, like this pattern, I thought was really cute at first, but I don't love it anymore because it kind of makes me look knock kneed or bow legged. So if you are bow legged and you don't really care to enhance that, I'd probably stray away from this kind of cut. <laughs> But just keep that in mind if you are looking to purchase a pair of this exact item. But just overall, the quality is impeccable. Like the way it holds and maintains its shape, and it's just, it just feels good on the body. It looks good on the body. Like I just, mm. Now I actually also have something else to show you. Hold on. Now this right here is my favorite combo. So I also picked up these sweats from Abercrombie. And baby, ah, oh, I'm gonna tell you guys, they're so good, so stinking good. Oh, I just can't get enough. I can't get enough. When I tell you I need two or three pairs, at least, minimum. Like I can't, oh, I have to place another order, I really do. They're so comfortable. Once again, the wide waistband makes it sit beautifully on the stomach it's not going down it's not turning over it's not doing nothing it's staying where i put her okay and i love that for me we got pockets the length is decent it falls right at the top of my ankle it is tapered and she's just so cute and comfy now i already posted a picture 
in the sweatshirt that matches the sweatpants. It's currently in my suitcase right now and I ain't unpacked my trip yet. So I said, I'm not even gonna stress myself out about it. Cause y'all, I just, I don't have it in me to tie with that suitcase right now, okay? But you see the vibes of this sweatshirt. So just imagine the matching top and bottom. I'll insert the picture so you guys can see, but it is cute. It is a vibe. When I tell you, I am obsessed with this look for fall. It's giving comfy and casual, but it's still giving like, Oh, she put herself together to time to really invest in her look and it's giving the vibes okay yeah yeah it's giving rich auntie but she's comfy okay and i love that for me and i also want to say even when you like pull up the sleeves it doesn't like get super stretchy and enlarged and loses its shape i have no issue doing this for like half a day and then just pulling it right back down and it's fine the quality is qualitying, okay? Abercrombie, y'all are doing something. Y'all are freaking doing something and I love that for us. Like I'm, ugh, ugh. So I picked up another style of sweatshirt. Now this one I've never worn or tried on, so. Oh, wait a minute, she feel a little tight. <laughs> oh, she feel a little tight, wait a minute. Wait a minute, okay. I got to work with the other ones because they were loose, which I love. This one seems to be more fitted to the body, which is scary because I got it in cream and I'm wearing a face full of makeup. I love that for us. Oh, okay, 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 okay. How are we feeling? Oh, I like this too. Of course, if I was wearing Oh, I like this. I like this. Yeah, this one is definitely form fitting. <laughs> this one is definitely true crop top. And, um, oh, she's really cute though. Oh, this is definitely something I'd wear without makeup for sure. <laughs> oh, but she's really cute. I mean, I'm not wearing the right bra for this, but imagine, please, respectfully. I don't wanna hear nothing about it. You wear it with the real ball when you buy it. Thank you, leave me alone. But this is really stinking cute, honey. This with some leggings, oh. Or even with jeans. Oh, this is really cute. Oh, and I love how long, like, I love how long this is. Ooh, oh, that's super cute. I feel like it makes my long arms look a little longer. Oh, and then like the wide lapels are just doing it for me. Oh, no. Oh no, this is so cute. Why didn't I get this look? Ooh. No, this is so cute. Ah! So the previous sweatsuit, I would absolutely wear to the airport. I would wear this to the airport too, like for a trip, but I feel like this is more so like I'm home, I'm going out, I wanna be cute and still comfortable. Like, yeah. This is that girl, honey. Oh, she's so cute. Now, I picked up this puffer. This is a weighted puffer. Oh, you can unzip the hoodie. Oh, that's cute. You can unzip the hoodie. There's a drawstring at the top so you can secure it. Oh, baby, they actually made this for cold weather, honey. Like, she is thick and she is heavy. Like, they actually made this for you to wear outside in the cold. Wowzers. She's cute. She does make me look wider. <laughs> um, and of course, puffers generally make you look wider, but this one is so thick and dense that just be prepared for that if you are interested in this. Honey, Joshy at the bottom, I can feel it right here. Where does it actually, let me see. Oh, on the inside, so you can get this to really be cropped. <gasps> oh, I love that right here. So you can show off the yams, honey. Can I get to the yams? Sweet yams. Show me the way. Cause I got bills to pay. <laughs> ah. Oh, shiver me timber. This is perfect for cold weather. If you like to layer, or if you like to wear a sweatshirt and just throw on a quick little something, cause you don't get that cold, but you get cold, but like not like that cold, this might be a girl. 
this might be your girl. Okay, these zipper pockets. Ooh, one thing about it, honey, they can make you work for that zipper though. Wait a minute. Oh. There we go. <gasps> the pockets are fleece lined. When I tell y'all, if you live in Boston and up, freezing cold weather, put this under your coat. Oh, this fleece and oh, feels amazing. This feels amazing. Oh, Abercrombie, Abercrombie. Why are you giving this to the girls like this? Oh my God. No, this is so cute. Oh, this is such a vibe. Oh, I'm a fan. I'm a fan, I'm a fan, I'm a fan. So I bought this reversible bomber jacket and I believe this is the piece I got in the, uh, in the 3XL. And I should have sized it down. Um, is that a tag? Cause how are you finna be reversible when you got this? Uh, am I tripping or am I seeing? I might be tripping. Am I tripping? Okay, whatever. But it's supposed to be reversible. So this is it on the black side. Like I said, I should have sized down. I don't want it to be as oversized. Cause I feel like when it's too oversized, it gets more casual and I want it to be a little bit on the dressier side. Not like dressy formal, but like dressy business cash, like a tailored, I don't say varsity jacket, but like, I just want it to be more tailored to my body. And when it's oversized like this, it gives like, I'm going to the gym, you know? And especially for like the interior, if I do like the black and brown side, like, no, I want this to give just a little bit more elevation, a little more class, if you may. My thing is, like, that's what I'm saying. How's this supposed to be reversible? Oh, reversible tear label away before wear. <laughs> All right, talk shit. Like, how you got a whole tag on it's reversible? <laughs> they also had another one that was, like, in gray, I think. And I was definitely eyeballing it. But, yeah, you see what I'm saying? Like, if you wore something like this with some cute slacks, like, it's not formal dressing, like, oh, my God, I'm about to go to a ball. But, like, it's a cute elevation of a basic bomber jacket, right? I thought this is so cute. I know somebody's gonna be like, oh, it's funny the way it is. And it probably is, but I gotta think about the future. I gotta think about the next couple of months, okay? And so I think I'm gonna get exchanges for a smaller size, but um, yeah, because you see, like, it just excess material, which is very good. Like, this is absolutely not a complaint. When have you ever had a 3X that had excess material? Like, I know I've been in the gym, but not that much, okay? For it to do this, nah. <laughs> No, nah. so I am not mad at these pieces, y'all. And I like that even though it is technically 2X or like XXL, in my mind, I was thinking that's like Fashion Nova or like junior sizing, but it's giving 2X, honestly. Like, and the pieces are such great quality. It is on a pricier side. Like, this is not Shein. I'm sorry to the girls. Um, it is on a pricier side, but you can see it and you can feel it in the quality of the materials or the weight of the materials. So if there's something that you love, or an item that you know you're gonna get a lot of wear out of, this is something that you should add to your Christmas list or add to your wish list, start saving towards it, add it to your to buy list and get a really quality piece that you know is gonna last you wash at their wash, at their wash, at their wash. Cause time at the time at the time I try to fight it. <laughs> well that is it for today's haul. God, I'm cutting up, y'all. It's been so long since I filmed the haul. But I am hoping that you guys love these pieces. I am so happy that I took the time to really look into this brand because I found so many th great things. And I did place a second order to try out more of their bottoms to see the slacks is given. So there will be a part two coming soon. But that is it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Toodles. <laughs> Time at the time at the time I try to fight it. <laughs>